Hi lovelies! Haven't seen you for a while, um, so I thought it was about time that I made a video. Um, it's kind of a two-in-one today because I want to show you these really cool palettes from Urban Decay. As you can see, I just love them. And the casing is like so nice. So I just wanted to quickly show you these and then I'm going to do um, a red lip tutorial because I've had a lot of people requesting that and just you know how you do a red lip without it kind of smudging and getting on your teeth and all sorts so we're going to just go through this and then I'll show you how to do that so this is the Urban Decay collaboration with Gwen Stefani and it's really kind of Gwen because it has so many vibrant colours and obviously she's really well known for that um, type of bold makeup and like a bold um, vibrant personality and it really shows in this collection so this is the eyeshadow palette which is amazing as you can see it has so many different colours and bright colours and I find normally when you get um, an eyeshadow palette it's kind of like a variation of the same colour like if you buy a nude palette it's got all nudes in or if you buy like a colour palette say navy or something it would be just a variation of navy whereas you know if you want to mix a look or do a different kind of look you have to buy a few different colours or palettes or singles which you don't have to do with this one because it's got so many different ones and so it's it's brilliant. This is the Gwen Stefani Urban Decay Blush Palette and I really really love this one because the casing is like white and gold, it's so pretty. And then the blush colours <gasps> to die. Oh my god, I love these colours so much. They're so like they're really summery, but you can kind of use this one here and this kind of rosy one, which is called Easy. Um in like the wintry months because they're quite uh, a ready kind of tone to them and it's just like I haven't seen a blush palette like this in a long time and I really really am excited about this whole collection um, because there's just so many really really nice colours and you have to just check it out so Urban Decay Gwen Stefani collaboration definitely one to try. So on with the perfect red lip tutorial and I'm just going to show you how I get kind of my perfect red lip and a couple of tricks that I use to just keep it on um, so that it kind of lasts for a, a good day. So what I'm going to use today is my BH Cosmetics 28 colour lip palette um, just because there's so many different reds and things in here and I really really like it as you can see. And you have to have a liner when you're doing a perfect red lip. So this is actually the Gwen Stefani Urban Decay liner and it's rock steady. So it's kind of a dark kind of red colour, which is obviously quite big this season. And I'm obviously going to use a lip brush because you get better definition around the edges, um, especially when you're using a palette. What I do to kind of prep my lips and get started, I've already done it today, but I just normally put some Vaseline on and leave it for about 10 minutes, rub it all in, just so that it can... Um, create a nice base for your lipstick because you don't want to have chap lips or rough lips when you're applying a lipstick because you want it to stay looking smooth so you have to have a good base it's just like putting a primer on under foundation so next we're gonna use this lip liner I'm just gonna go around the edges just to create the line and do it slightly into um, your lips so that you've not got a real sharp line around the edge of your lips So as you can see I've gone in to the centre of my lip slightly so that it can also blend into the colour that you're going to put on the top. And make sure you stick to the shape of your lips because I've seen some people um, that have kind of gone over the top of their lip line which looks fine on camera but when you're with someone in person you can see that and it looks really silly. So just stick to your lips, love your lips, if they're thin or big love your lips and just stick to your natural shape. So now I'm going to use the... BH Cosmetics palette to fill in the colour and I'm going to find one that just kind of matches the Gwen Stefani Rocksteady um, just to keep it consistent colour. So I'm going to go for like a mix of this one here and this one here also so it's like a nice dark red colour which is obviously really in right now. Using my little lip brush to keep the, the nice smooth lines. Okay so when you've finished just make sure that you've kind of rubbed your lips together to make sure it's all blended in and if you find that you've got outside of the line a bit just use your finger 
and just go around and smooth any edges that you think you know you've kind of gone out of the shape what you need to do is just get a tissue and literally just place it between your lips and kind of blot off just once so just like that rub your lips together again and that will get off any excess and then use your finger and just put it between your lips and draw it out so that gets off anything that's kind of right in the center of your lips and that will prevent any lipstick from going on your teeth so if you follow those tips you should have perfect lips for the whole day so don't forget to check out natashacox.com for any other tips or tutorials there's loads of makeup and lipstick tutorials on there and i would love to see you over there and don't forget to let me know if there's anything that you would like to know how to do or like to do a video on then just comment below and i hope that i'll be able to get that done um, for you all to see thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye